So, how to not have sex before marriage? This is a big one. So, I believe that regardless, if even if you want to date somebody, I think that you need to keep your hands to yourself. That's just, if you're not married, like, you need to keep your hands to yourself. Um, I think that one thing that my wife and I did as we saw that we were getting more intimate we got married and um we decided to have sort of a quick marriage and we got married and then you know that's we dated for a year we dated for a whole year and you know we went to the same church for longer than that but um you know, I think if you are wanting to not have sex before marriage, which is the way that God wants it, you know, I think that you have to be honest. Don't even touch yourself. Um, I think that you don't don't masturbate. You know, if you're looking at porn, you need to quit looking at porn, you know, but don't even start the fire. You know, obviously, God he believes that masturbation is wrong you know it's not right for you to pleasure yourself and so it's hard to hear and your mind could think oh maybe it's not wrong well that's a trick you know your mind is not gonna your mind is not god your brain is not god so your brain is not telling you all that is right and wrong and the bible calls it uncleanness that's what it, it's, it's not very clear in scripture but sexual sins it calls the bible calls it sexual sin sexual immorality or it calls it calls it uncleanness and so um don't don't even if you're if you're already doing that or you already have which is most likely the case then you need to um you know i think talk to somebody I think you need to take it very seriously, you know. Um, I personally didn't quite see that it was a problem until I actually started reading the Bible and I got into Leviticus, and it it had Leviticus had a, a bunch of sex rules, and so um, you know I didn't quite see it. It was wrong until you know I actually started reading the Bible for myself. And so, um, I think you seek and you will find, right? Jesus said that. And so, um, you know, don't, don't play with fire. Like you can date someone and you can be direct. Just tell them, Hey, I'm really interested in you. You know, let's be more than friends, but don't, don't let touching try to secure your relationship. You know, use your words say you know you can tell someone that you love them tell someone that you like them um but you can also um you know what what i was gonna say was you can date them and be friends find a friend first and then find a, a sex partner <laughs> you know like find a friend find someone you can be friends with find someone that you can get along with and um and then find someone it's easy you can find someone to have sex with like you're you, you're not going to be looking far but trying to find someone that you actually holds the same values as you believes in jesus you know don't date someone that is not uh, a christian if you're a christian you know because they're going to have different beliefs about what their behavior should be and so you know again don't even play with the fire you know of sex don't even try to have little or or, or like oh i'm not having intercourse i'm not having full on sex but we're still touching and and you know touching each other and different things like that i think you need to stay away from that you know don't don't do it because it just it gets your emotions high and even if you're touching yourself you're you're gonna be more inclined to look at porn 
or to get into any relationship really fast because you're already uh, like thinking about sex and you're already doing sexual things on your own and so you're not really thinking with your head but you're just trying to get with anybody you know and it's it's almost anybody you know anyone if they're just nice to you and they they smile and different things like that then you're not really thinking like oh is this where person a christian let me ask them questions you're like okay you know how far away am i until we both are in bed together so that's my opinion that's i believe what the bible says as well it's more than an opinion i believe that's what the word of god says is that we need to you know be proper when you're dating and if you're crossing that line don't wait too long to get married you know just because oh you know uh we've only dated for so long you know but you're already like dry humping and different things like that i shouldn't say that sorry for saying that but if you're already doing stuff like that like you cross the line and you need to go ahead and get married so hope you learned from something from this video thank you